was there, began live after Jean-Marc Berlin when they hosted a faltering Nice side at the Stade de la Deschamps. The hosts fell into a 2-1 defeat to Clermont last weekend. Berlin dismissed from his coaching duties on Tuesday to a run of six games without a win. Zegong disappointingly lost by the same scoreline to Slovakia in the Open Conference League, did just about hang on for a 3-2 win over Troyes. His three points failed to improve upon a lowly 13th place in the table. The visitors got off to the perfect start this weekend. Andy Delors waiting unmarked in the six-yard box to turn into an empty net. Great work from Kefren Tiram, storming past four or five Auxerre defenders before laying it on a plate for his striker. Just about stayed on side, remaining behind the ball. The goal scorer's match wouldn't last much longer though. Fairly innocuous looking tangle of legs. He battled for a header with Paul Jolly. Proved to be terminal. The Nice fans' mood continues to worsen as the host grabs an equaliser just before half time. Matthias Eltre whipping in a corner and picking up a first assist in the season as Nuno da Costa headed home his second goal of the season. Getting ahead of his man. And then making no mistake, heading down into the turf, past Kasper Schmeichel. So level at the break. Os Nice would have been the favourites on paper, certainly before the season. Orzair had won six of their previous eight home top flight games against Nice, and now had the wind in their sails. And indeed, they would create the first chance of note in the second period. As in Sinioko somehow squirming away from two Nice players, releasing a low shot, and Schmeichel had to tip round the far post with his fingertips. Marlian still looking for his first goal in the top flight. Tide would turn, however, with a sloppy pass out from the back. And Latomba nicking in and taking on the shot with his next touch, only able to find the side netting. Shortly after, two ex Premier League summer signings combined, almost a great effect. La Pepe with a brilliant ball over the top. Ross Barkley volley narrowly wide. Was there though, who would come close to grabbing the winner? Ball from the right, headed up in the air, only to fall at the feet of Bain Yang. Senegal International smashing his half volley into the base of the post. And that would be the final chance. On his even at the final whistle, certainly not the worst start for former assistant Michel Padovani, acting as Ozer's interim coach. A single point enough to narrowly climb out of the drop zone.